NBC Sports thanks you for watching this special presentation of the National Football League. This week, Jimmy is a flag. With BTS, Jessica Alba, Big Sean, Eddie Redmayne, and Keith Urban. And Monday, Kevin Hart, The Tonight Show. surgery? Maybe it's time to stop putting it off. Because at Yale New Haven Health, we have a 10-step safety program to ensure that all our facilities are clean, safe, and ready to treat you at a moment's notice. Learn more at ynhhs.org. Tracking rain making its way to Connecticut. First alert, future radar showing us what will be here soon, and we certainly could use that rain. Thanks so much for being with us tonight. I'm Dan Corcoran. Meteorologist Josh Singrinelli joins us more on when this rain is going to get here and how long it sticks around in your first alert forecast. Hey there, Josh. Well, Dan, yeah, Dan, it's just a few hours away. We are going to be dealing with scattered rain showers, especially in southern Connecticut. Take a live look right now over New Haven. It's dry in the New Haven area and really statewide. Temperatures across the state are falling quickly. It's on the chilly side, especially for areas right along the Massachusetts border. It's 46 degrees in Colbert, 53 in Windsor Lots, and in Willimantic right now, 50 degrees. Take a look at this. Live first alert Doppler radar is quiet, but as I zoom things out and show you the satellite loop, we have a ton of moisture just down to our south and west. Most of this moisture will actually push off to the east and miss us to the south. However, we will see a few scattered rain showers develop after midnight. You'll notice scattered rain showers in the southwestern Connecticut by 4 a.m. and heavier showers into southern Connecticut through tomorrow morning's commute. But by tomorrow afternoon, we actually dry things out. And it's not until tomorrow night and early Tuesday morning that we see a second round of rain. And that round of rain can amount to up to a half inch and some very heavy rain. Temperatures overnight falling back into the 40s and 50s. Scattered showers overnight. Those scattered showers more likely in southern Connecticut. We'll take you town by town, hour by hour, take you through the entire work week. Right into next weekend, I'll head in my full first alert forecast. Dan, back to you. Josh, thank you. Well, there are dueling messages from people in New Haven tonight. Some are ready to celebrate Columbus Day, while others are pushing for greater acceptance of Indigenous Peoples Day. NBC Connecticut's Matt Austin has that story. 